Well, welcome back. You know, many kids look forward to back to school shopping and the opportunity to pick out supplies and the clothing and socks for all the upcoming school year. It's exciting, but it can be stressful because unfortunately that isn't possible for a lot of the young people in the city. And that's exactly why our next guest is doing something to help. The CEO of She's Happy Foundation, Warren Broadnax, is joining us now to explain how did this all start? Because this is the sixth year you're doing it. Yes, yes. It actually started uh, with me and uh, my business partners with She's Happy Hair. Uh, we came from poverty and poverty situations, and growing up, we experienced problems having school supplies and not having all the right equipment going back to school. So when we were able to come get a little bit of success in business, we felt like a moral obligation to give back to those who were a little bit less unfortunate like we once were. And this is so great because you're a born and raised Houstonian. As you said, you have your own story that goes along with this. But besides, you started off, I think, with mentoring first and then realized that there was a greater need. Yes, yes, definitely. Uh, just talking to kids and realizing, like, they need help. Uh, and everybody needs a helping hand. At one point in time, I needed a helping hand. So we're going to try to give out as many helping hands as possible. Well, and it's also nice to cover, you know, everyone's basic necessities going back to school. You should be focusing on learning and having the basic tools is, is a huge leg up. We just saw some video on the screen of people collecting backpacks. So what exactly are you giving away? So we'll be giving away 200 backpacks at all three She's Happy Hair Houston locations. There'll be 200 backpacks each location. They'll be fully stocked with pens, pencils, school supplies, and paper. So all they have to do is pick up the backpack and they should be ready to go and learn the first day of school. That's fantastic. And it really is because, you know, not having those tools on the first day um, gives that child a little bit of a stigma that they kind of they would stick out that they don't have what they need and that's every kid needs to start on that same level yeah. in the classroom and in the school I mean that's what's so important about learning definitely 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 yeah, I think that mental stigma that you're speaking of that first day if you're going and everybody's pulling out paper and pulling out a backpack you just don't feel that significant if you don't have one and we want to try to impact and make sure as many kids don't feel like that as possible and Warren, I think it's great that you are doing so much to help the community. You mentioned earlier that part of the reason you're doing this is because you remember what that was like to be a young person in the class. By providing these school supplies for other young people out there, what has it brought you? Um, I have learned a saying that I've been hearing all, all my life, it's better to give than receive. Uh, I think that's truly where we get our joy from. Uh, being a successful business owner now, I'm kind of got success and it doesn't excite me as much seeing those kids faces knowing that getting a hug from a strange kid that you don't know just because you made their day by giving them a backpack something very insignificant to you that means the world to them so watching those smiles that's what means the world to me making a difference for sure we just saw on the screen the locations there's three different locations across houston first come first serve uh there they are there on the screen from 12 to 4. and if you'd like more information you can always check out the website she's happyhair.com warren broadnax thank you so much for